Welcome to the Tradex Foods 3-Minute Market Insight. Here's the seafood news for the week of January 28, 2013. The sockeye salmon market has shifted over the past few weeks. Higher than normal fresh sales during the fishing season resulted in a shortage of frozen inventories. As you may recall, prices rose steadily and sharply on sockeye with processors expecting to fall short of contracted sales. Early season sockeye prices were 275 to 295 a pound FOB Seattle. Current prices have been reported as high as 425 a pound FOB Seattle for Alaska MSC fish. Russian sockeye has been a factor in the recent months with domestic buyers turning to Russia supply, Russian supply for price relief and to ensure they have the raw material to fill their fillets and portion needs. Prices are 50 to 75 cents lower for Russian fish than the current prices for Alaskan products. There have been several reports of quality problems with some of the Russian fish recently imported into both Canada and the USA. International trade with Russian fishing companies often requires 100% payments prior to the product's arrival. Given the wide range of quality of Russian sockeye, we are recommending due diligence on the part of buyers to ensure you are not surprised by poor quality product arriving at your door. Despite some of the possible hazards involving buyers, involved buyers are able to purchase very high quality MSC sockeye from Erzerna River through reputable importers who are experienced in this trade. All of this means it's all what all of this means is shortages and strong prices for sockeye and sockeye products. Sockeye fillets are in short supply with more demand than product. Naturally, prices are up as a result and are often and are expected to climb even further over the coming months with no new production expected for at least five to six months. Sockeye fillet prices are 665 to 685 US dollars per pound which is up 30 cents a pound since the summer months. On an unrelated note, buyers at Chum Salmon may have noticed far fewer MSC Chum Salmon offers in the marketplace. Supply of premium quality Chum Salmon has dried up and MSC fish has become short in supply due to the large sales to China and Europe. Similar supply conditions exist for Pink Salmon, Chinook and Coho Salmon. In the big picture, salmon shortages will worsen until the new production season. Buyers should seriously consider purchasing now to avoid running out, out, running out or having to buy inferior quality products later. Lastly, I want to show you a photo courtesy of one of our customers that took a picture of our Sinbad Pangaceous compared to two other competitors. This shows the difference in value when products are purchased based on price. Check out the high resolution version of the image on our website at tradexfoods.com slash news. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3 Minute Market Insight. This is Robert Ryerson by Smart and Eat More Seafood.